Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Another FS19 gaming video. Pretty excited about this video guys. I've been really working hard on this truck. Uh, I guess we're going to call this uh, Darth Dooley 2.0. You guys that have been following my channel for a long time know I had a 2002 uh, Silverado 3500 all black and it was uh, known as Darth Dooley so I guess this will be Darth Dooley 2.0 guys and it's the shop truck for Mossman 381 garage finally finished her up a lot of work's gone into this thing guys I'm gonna do a walk around show you a bunch of stuff that I've done And I guess we can start at the front there. I've already showed you the lights. Um, I think that's so cool that the Chevrolet's lit up. Okay, so um, looking at the truck, guys, uh, I raised it probably inch and a half. Um, it would be in real life, not a huge lift. But I just wanted to get it a little higher to get it to look a little better. Uh, then uh, the new wheels and tires are on there, guys. These are um, American Force, I guess. Um, Tritons, I think. Uh, I tried to find something that I I liked. And these are the ones I kind of liked. I don't really like the low-profile tires. Uh, I've been looking for some BFGs. But um, the BFGs I found have white letters on them. I don't really like the white letter. Um, I like the aggressiveness of these tires, though. So we'll see. These might grow on me. Um, I don't have them sticking way out of the truck. Like um, a, lot of, a lot of guys want the tires just sticking way out. I don't really understand that. I think uh, this is a much more sophisticated look when they're not just hanging halfway or completely out of the fenders. But I like where these are. I like where these are. I like the size. Guys, I tweaked these things and tweaked them. And finally, I found what I liked. So that's what I did. Oh, another um, addition to the truck is the rack. Now that's a factory uh, Chevy or GM rack. You can get them for the Silverados and the Sierras. Uh, I put my name there. I put the Mossman up there. Uh, usually there's a Silverado or a Sierra in red there. And I thought that would be neat to put uh, the Mossman there. So that's what I did. Um, you can see I got a full stainless exhaust in this thing. And then I dumped it um, dumped it after the axle with a with a black tip. Uh, I just don't like that big factory exhaust hanging out, and that that'll start looking kind of old after a while anyway. So I thought that was a good uh, good compromise. Some people dump it uh, before the axle. I don't really like that. But anyway, continuing around here. Uh, probably going to change the lights on that rack. I don't know if I like them, them little light bars, but uh, what else have we done, guys? I've tweaked uh, this truck and tweaked it. I got a lot of time in it. Uh, I guess we can get inside. I can show you. Um, did uh, a blue chrome on the piping under the hood. I mean, the hood pops up. I guess we might as well do something under here. So, I thought that was neat. Um, with the lift, I did the lower my snow plow mounts a little bit. I have tweaked the, the bumper a little on this thing, too. Just to make it look a little better, I think. But um, all the chrome might go away eventually. I think it kind of all goes together. You see the little bit of aluminum on the on the rims there. Then you got a little uh, 3500 badge. You got the chrome handles. You got uh, 
the moss man right there and then you've got a little bit of chrome on the hood so I think um, this is probably the way I'll leave it for a while I might completely black it out eventually but right now this is what I got guys I'm pretty pretty happy with it and um, I think it looks awesome so I'd buy this truck I'd buy a 2020 that looked like this. So guys, we're going to put the shop truck to work here. Uh, I want a, a forklift for the shop. So we're going to head over and grab a forklift. Gotta adjust this because um, of the, the lift. We gotta adjust that hitch there. I think we're looking good. Having a little forklift in the shop is just uh, just a little easier to move things around. And I have a pallet racking for the skid steer or pallet forks for the skid steer but it's just easier to move things with a with a little forklift It's just the in-game forklift there. That truck looks so awesome, guys. It looks so awesome. I forgot to put my ramp down. Working on a custom trailer for it, guys, to go with the truck. Hopefully that'll stay. I don't think this thing will get, I don't think it'll tie down. So.
Well, I guess that's going to do it, guys, for this one. First job for the shop truck completed. Uh, look for more on this thing, guys. we got to get a snow plow for it. Probably going to get some uh, some type of strobe lights for it. And then i got to tweak some things here and there, I think, probably off and on. But um, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. And I guess I'll see you guys.